right. Out here checking up on this project. This is gonna be absolutely epic. I say that all the time, but trust me, this is a one of a kind. Let's go take a little walk around, see what's going on. Here's the men themselves. Uh, welcome to the job site. Flashback. All right, what's up, punks? Huh? Oh. We are moving kind of slow, but it's been a rainy mud fest the last few days. Here's the mud, Bob. Mud, mud. Yeah, it's, it's, it just looks messy right now, but we're getting there. A little while later. We got our basin. We got to set up with street rails. Beautiful Monday here. Multiple crises have been averted. And we're ready to do what we do best. 80 minutes later. Street master doing his thing. We started screeting yesterday and got this section laid in so our pattern is established. Five minutes later. All right, moment of truth. Told you we were going to connect the dots when we came around this way, but we finally got the first piece to interlock here. Fingers crossed, drops in with a perfect fit. So all that math I did back in high school finally playing <laughs> off. Here we go. Let's do it. Oh. Yeah. yeah, boy. Let's do it. <laughs> One pair of pants later. A uh, beautiful job here we've been working on for the last couple seasons. These guys got veneered, and we're going to do the caps today on this planter box and on this planter box over here, which is also veneered. Yeah, we're going to knock out these today. We're going to get some holes drilled in these caps on top of these pillars all the way around. We've got pillars over there and there and there. And then, oh, yeah, this thing got built. <laughs> Pretty awesome. No water in the pool yet, but there's a little frog down there. All right, y'all stay tuned. Later. Let's show them how it's done. Jay, you want to start with the big one? What is that thing? Man, that sucks. 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 There you go, folks. A little backpack vacuum system. Pick up that big piece of traffic too. Move it right out of the way. This patty has settled a little more. So we're out here raising these guys up, fixing the ones that settled. That was on the guys that were supposed to tamp the ground and roll it out properly before the pool was totally finished around the edges. But, you know, sometimes you just got to do what you got to do and deal with the problems as they come. So a couple more lifts to do, a couple more pieces to fix, and this patty is going to look great. The next melding. Back here at the vacation yard. Sun to shine by day. Things going on. Got folks fixing the palapala. Folks putting in the outdoor kitchen. We laid all the pavers yesterday. Got them cut in in this area. Did this little walkway over here as well. And now today, me and the boys here, we're gonna go and we're gonna lay pavers from here all around this area between this pillar and that pillar. Around here to this pillar and inside this little bar area. Be a nice outdoor bar sitting area here coming along real nice several long days later all right folks welcome back to this epic backyard it's been a while it's been a long time the Palapala has been finished. The border is in. I sell, of course, on this whole project. There are a few little tweaks we have to do on the travertine patio still. Here, there, as you go around, just a couple little spots to lift. This Grande Teco Block patio came out really, really nice. That needs tamped still. Still got some edge creating to do. We also cored in these little one inch holes throughout the border where uh, these will be little lights that light up the walkway as you go around. Uh, we just finished this circular walkway around this flower bed. Came out really nice. And that leads out into a nice green yard where lots of activities happen here at this house. That was fun drawing out all those, but we got that done. We're going to go under here and check out this techo block patio that has been a tumultuous thing for us. First of all, you throwing too many big words at me. But we finally got it figured out and locked in. Came out really nice. This kitchen is going to be super awesome. We just touched up a few spots in here with the poly today. It's still a little wet. We'll stay off of that. Painter's doing his thing inside. Going to look real nice. This bar, whew, the only new. The headaches, anxiety, and troubles that the height of this bar caused us. But the guys at LAP, they took care of this today. Did a great job. We got to bring up a little soil here around our edge here on the back side. But overall, this project has come out top notch in my opinion. Through all the ups and downs. I mean, I can imagine having this in my backyard. Even after I build it, it still seems like something you see in a resort. Stay tuned for the palm trees and the finishing touches, y'all. C.E. Pond Sons. You already know. One shift later. All right, we go, Bobby. Back out at the job, getting all kind of travers or uh, pavers all through here, all through here. Pool was Pebble Tech last week. Looks good. Cool color. Real nice. Check back, Bobby. A little later. All right, all right, y'all. Welcome back to a little piece of paradise in Pennsylvania. Great project, is, as you know, taking some time to finish, but projects as big do not get done quickly. So underneath here, the boys started the Teco Block paver patio. Started laying that in. There's more 
more to be done over here, but the pool guy might have to dig that up for a reason that's not ours. So we'll find out about that soon. And then I gotta finish some, bringing things up to grade over here, screeting and then finish laying that little section. And then over yonder here, we're gonna cut in the soldier course all along this walkway here to meet up where the soldier course was cut in. We'll call it a sailor, not a soldier, if be correct about it. So this was all cut in today. All this was cut in today. So that looks real sharp though with the, with the double border on it. Excuse all my cut pieces of travertine there clean that up still but yeah beautiful and then yeah that's a pretty pool there really is a beaut but uh yeah end of the day here closing time you know what that means i'm gonna wrap it up head home stay tuned y'all stay tuned end of flashback everybody's nice hot sweaty today got this super sick travertine patio and walkway techo block edging humongous pool and it's super sweet got these planners going up there gonna get some lights on them look at that custom cabana chilling in the shade techo block patio underneath here oh travertine still there another planner the lights going on up there or actually those got gas lines those might actually be uh tiki torches a little nice sun shelf in the pool be a perfect day to be sitting over there still a lot of grading and seating to be done out there i believe the homeowner's taking over all that and gonna do the planning himself got this massive structure over here outdoor kitchen over there working on the fire pit right there outdoor kitchen that big garage in the back all techo block patio underneath here quite the epic fireplace over there nice little bar countertop most important part where we keep all the cold beverages beautiful that travertine patio is got one last walkway going back in through there and i think that's pretty much a wrap for us these nice palms I said i think the homeowner is going to do most of the planning and stuff himself so i'll have to come back when that's all finished bring the drone out here some sick shots of this bad boy especially when it's all lit up at night it's gonna look crazy too there's torches going in on there got the gas lines that's gonna be sick can't wait to show y'all when it's done can't wait to see it for myself Boosh.